In today's video, we're going to go on the most popular escalation server and we're going to get literally my best start that I have ever gotten in my 8,000 hours. If you guys would like to see more, make sure to drop a like, let's try to reach 200 likes and subscribe if you haven't already since each one helps the channel grow much more than you think. In my last video, I announced a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. If you're watching and want to claim this mythical, make sure that you have joined the Discord, which will be linked in the description below. And today we're going for another one, which is an Ice Dragon Unkept Ponytail donated by Desmond. If you guys want to win this, make sure that you have liked, subscribed and comment something below. And if you are a channel member, you also have a higher chance of winning this mythical. We are currently doing an event where if you guys wishlist a game on Steam, you will get a free on-turn skin. All you have to do is join the Discord, which will be linked in the description below. Follow the rules, wishlist the game, open a ticket, send your trade link, and you will receive the skin in around a few hours. The skins can be a rare, epic, legendary, premium, or even a mythical, and I hope to see you guys participate in this event. Alright boys, just logged into Escalation and I'm in a base. Alright, well, I'm just gonna suicide. I have a, I have a gun and a chainsaw and two of my posters. Alright, so we're currently on the most popular Escalation server that there is right now. And we're going to try to get ourselves uh, a good run. We're not gonna be alone. We're gonna invite some of my friends to join. And hopefully we'll get ourselves uh, a good run. There's a guy here. Get over here. Oh. Alright, so one of my teammates... Uh, we've been farming around for a little bit, and I think he found this base, which I think decayed. Yeah, it did decay. Or was not fully raided or something. Oh my god. Bro, there is no way we found this. Look at this. There's guns, there's raiding gear. Bro, this base just decayed. I don't even have space. I only have some firefighter clothes. Look at this. There's so much. Oh my god, it doesn't end. There's wood as well, so we can build. Bro, there's like high tier stuff. Oh my god. What the hell, man? Alright, this feels kind of scripted. I assure you it is not. We just found this base which apparently decayed and there was a, a bunch of loot in it. Or it was not fully raided or something. I don't know exactly what it is, but... Bro, this has to be my best start on escalation. One of my teammates logged off close. I think he logged off in the save zone. He was just swimming. <laughs> and he found this. Bro, there's no way... So I see. Oh, oh, there we go, bro. From or from there we got so much stuff, man. We got we got all of us got a midnight sword already. This is absolutely insane. So um, we're gonna go build a base. We don't even have a base, so I guess building a base is probably the best idea for us to do uh, this early on. We don't want to die with all of this loot. We filled up all of our vaults as well. So yeah, we're gonna go build a base, man. That's what we're gonna do now. And with the sword. We can run so quick and, bro, with just three hits, you chop down a tree. Yeah, we're gonna build somewhere around here, probably. I think this would be a, a pretty nice location. There's a base here, which I think is actually unraided. Yeah, we found ourselves an unraided base as well. Bro, this is absolutely insane. Yeah, he got raiding gear as well, dude. Bro, this has to be my best start. Finding a decayed base underwater that was full of that much loot is absolutely insane but first before raiding we should build a base so that we get ourselves some insane loot we can just depot it you know so i don't lose everything if we die once all right so base is done now what we're going to do is we're going to go raid our neighbor our crates are well technically not empty they do have quite a lot of loot in them one of our teammates did log off for a little bit as well but we're gonna go give this raid a try and hopefully we'll get ourselves uh, something good from it. Get ourselves some leathers as well. Alright, and here we go. We're gonna raid the neighbor first so that if they log on or something, they wouldn't raid us first. I, I don't think they're online, but we're gonna raid them anyway. Today's video is sponsored by Pine Hosting. Are you guys trying to start your own unturned server and have no clue where to start? Then check out Pine Hosting. Point hosting is super easy to learn, the navigation is also very user friendly and not hard at all to learn. All the servers have really high performance with DDoS protection. When I started my own servers, I had no idea how to do anything, but after a few minutes I learned the basics. They have locations all around the globe, the pricing is also very cheap, and they also have a variety of game servers to choose from, including Rust, Arc, and also Minecraft. A really good feature by Pine Hosting is the ability to install plugins and mods just by clicking once. If you have a server with another provider, Pine Hosting can help you move them as well. Make sure to check out Pine Hosting today and use the code LDG for 30% off, and let's get straight into the video. Alright, here we go. We should raid this part over here, perhaps. Alright, we are through. And it's completely empty. Okay, well... The, the bed's not even claimed. Alright, insane first raid. 
could have definitely been better. Found ourselves another base. Oh, he's using explosive. Yeah, those don't raid apparently. And we're gonna go through the floor. Yep, we are through crates, empty, some guns. I mean, I'll take the asset. Yeah, nothing that good. <laughs> yeah, this was not a good raid either. We'll switch the clothes. I guess we got better clothes. There's some shots going on, so let's go try to kill them. Bro, with the Midnight Sword, it's so OP, man. We're so fast. Oh, there. I, I they see a dead I see a dead guy. So he's probably inside the bunker. Oh, yeah, he's right there. There we go. He's dead. Headshot. There's more. Someone threw a grenade. Uh, this guy. Oh, he had a private. We'll strip it just for its ammo. So something that also I want to mention is that in this building, the new building, you can get a, the LDG poster. So it's a new spawn. So if you guys want to get yourself the poster of my logo, then you can get it from inside here. So it's pretty cool, actually. It's by a corner. Where are the other people at, man? There were other people around. I don't know where they... Oh, oh yeah, we got the rocket launcher and the, the new grenade launcher, so... Oh, shots up there. I assume they're going on the hill or something, yeah. So let's head over there. He's right there. Um, I missed. There's somebody else. Somebody else just dropped. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, he got knifed. Oh, I hit him. He's running. All right, let's switch out the the knight, the the, the sword, so that we can run fast. There, poor guy's gonna get. Oh, dude, he's actually. Oh, there we go. He's dead. Bro, I killed him mid there. That was kind of epic. Okay, he had a compact. I mean, we're gonna take as much guns as possible so that we can fit it up in base, but I don't really need them, to be honest. We do have ourselves a bunch of Tempests and uh, Noct's in base for PvP, so... So good. There's a naked there. There we go, hit him. He's just a naked, though. Alright, and this guy had an Ulfbert. Okay, don't need any of those, man. Oh, there we go, he's dead. Let's go see if he had anything good. There's a pretty large base around here as well, actually. Oh, he was geared. Okay, he had an Elise spell. I'm getting shot. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, nice. My teammate got him. Okay, good. Bro, I got two tapped by a pistol. Insane. Oh, my teammate died. Okay, this is bad because I only have a sniper. There you go. Hit him. Oh, I died. Well, GG, we just lost all of our... All of our loads. Okay. Uh, no problem. I mean, we didn't really lose anything that special, but that was... uh, Yeah, we lost some loads. There's a guy right here. Oh, what? He doesn't even see me. Oh, I hit him. Wait, is he okay? Bro, I'm sorry. I have to kill you. I need your gun. There we go. Yeah, we got ourselves uh, two guns. Yeah, poor guy had no ammo either. And this gun, at least. Or somebody else. Oh, no, that's my teammate. <laughs> Never mind. I think he killed someone, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. There's so much guns. There's another guy over there. Hit him. Hit him again. There, he's dead. All right. Yeah, we'll take ourselves some of the guns that we should use. Got myself a scope on the private. Let's right, reload our guns as well. Uh, what the hell, bro's playing music, man. Bro, shut up. There we go, he's dead. Yeah, we're very close to where we died, so maybe we could kill the guy that killed us. I left him at 30 HP, man, and feels bad that I only had the sniper equipped. And if we do manage to find out where he lives or where, where he is, that would be really good. I'm gonna jump down and try to get myself, like, an Ares or something. Not an Ares, an Asset. There we go, they're all dead. Uh, compact, some Nitro. Yeah, we didn't get what we need. It's alright, though. We can use these guns, it's whatever. I'll use Compact. Compact's actually quite good, even though it's burst. There's a guy in here. There we go, he's dead. Yeah, he had some guns. Nothing crazy, though. Uh, we could, like, salvage all of the guns later on. It would give us a lot of metal, too. And with that metal, we can make lockers and all of that. Let's put ourselves a sight on the Yuri as well. There's a guy up there. Oh, it's a naked, though. There, I hit him once. Yeah, he's running. Bro's running for his life. There's a dude here. Hit him. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, finally, I got myself an asset, man. I've been waiting so long to get an asset. It's absolutely insane. Seems like a lot of PvP is happening around this large base as well, actually. So I don't really know what's going on. Either it's live or something. There's more people coming, I assume, as well. Yeah, my teammate's gonna come back for his loot. 
get a see where they're coming from and they may have like a sky base or something I don't know if they're allowed on the swipe sometimes they are allowed sometimes they aren't allowed genuinely I don't even know oh there's a dude there uh, he's, he has a gun so I'm gonna try to kill him obviously let's push up where did bro go wait what where did he go wait I lost him oh he's right here there you go he's dead uh, he has... Oh, okay, he has... Dude, he has a bunch of metal and a bunch of components. Yeah, we'll take all of these. I should actually depot this. I have myself a full inventory of loot, so I should depot all of this. Bro, that was actually really good. Yeah, I'm gonna home. There's people down here. And yeah, there's another dude. Alright, they're both down. So my teammate did... My teammate did a trade. Um... Apparently he got a, a blast strike or something. He found some lockers underwater next to that decayed base we found. Um, so apparently we're gonna go raid them. I think that's a that's that's a good plan. A shots going on over here. Yeah, there's a there's two dudes. All right, let three guys. All right, let, we gotta kill this guy. How is he not dead? I headshot him twice. All right, let's kill this guy first. There we go. He's dead. Oh, they're actually shooting each other. Poor guys, man. They're gonna get destroyed. Oh, he killed them. Oh, hello there. Yeah, he oh! I thought he was dead. He was hiding in the loot. Now they're all dead. Uh, okay, he had Ulfbert, some clothes. And this guy had... Uh, but oh, he had an asset. Okay. I did not know. I don't know. Think he had an asset. I thought he had like... I don't know, like a private or something. Or an Ulfbert. Assets are always good to get. Alright, we got ourselves the bomb strike down. Um, I gotta get a bit far away. I don't want to die. Yeah, but bro, wait, did it break? Oh, it did. Oh my god, that was insane. Bro, that was the best throw ever. There's so much loot as well. Uh, I already see a bunch of knockout loot. What? Oh my god, bro, there's no way. All right, let's switch to Elise back. Let's drop the Elise back first things first. Bro, look at how much money there is as well. High cal guns. We got devastate. Oh my god, bro, there's so much high cal. What is this? Uh, we got ourselves a bomb str- Alright, well, um, we're gonna have to take all of this loot. Bro, <laughs> there is no way we got this much loot! Bro, I have never seen this much loot in my life on Escalation. Oh yeah, we're taking all of the C4. Bro, we're gonna have to do multiple runs. We got so- three HMTs right over here. Uh, we gotta be careful of our breath. Alright, well, we're gonna have to do multiple depots. Uh, one of us is gonna stay here, probably. And we TP back and forth and make a billion lockers and move everything over, man. This is insane. Bro, we literally got base parts from this. We're gonna upgrade our base. We got a full, like, base from it. <laughs> it's absolutely insane. We gotta get more, though. Like, we gotta probably make some... a bit of wood. Or maybe if I do it like this for now, I salvage this roof. Because this is actually a roof, not a floor. So we could have put it right over there and then seal off like this and just extend it by a 2 by one and not by a 2 by 2 Yeah, this is actually perfect. I still have myself a few walls as well. And then we could salvage this wall and we have we have enough, we would have extended the base. Gotta get myself some more logs for more crates. You gotta do it quick before all of the loot despawns as well, you know? I don't want my loot to despawn. Alright, salvage that. Now we could, uh, we're probably gonna make ourselves the second floor as well later on. Yeah, we're starting to depot the good stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna get more wood so then I make more crates, obviously. If we get a toolbox from the raid, that would be so good because we can start making industrial lockers too. I don't know if there was any though, but it would be great if we get... We got ourselves a bunch of industrial lockers too. My teammate made a bunch from with the toolbox, so uh, that's really good. Our base is starting to get stacked. Whoever's gonna raid our base is gonna get so much loot, it's gonna be insane. We're double stacking the lockers as well, putting them on each other. Hoping that they actually get placed good. Bro, we have so much metal as well. We can upgrade all of this base into full metal if we get ourselves a bunch of oil. Which we actually did get. There was like a stack of oil. Yeah, we're gonna get ourselves enough space, obviously, for... For all of that load over there. 
We're not gonna have any problem raiding whatever we want on the server. Alright, so we're working on uh, second base. We're gonna do the second base. I mean, second floor, not the second base. I'm gonna make myself the floor over here. So we're gonna actually upgrade it reinforced already. So that, you know, I, I don't have to upgrade it later on. We probably will make it into full metal though, I'm not gonna lie. But we'll focus on that later on. Really not, not really not an issue right now. So what we're going to do soon is we're going to go raid that big base that we found. There was a lot of PvP going on over there. Um, apparently it is live. And it's like a big group as well. So we're gonna give that a try. We're gonna try to raid it. And, um, you know, it's a large metal base. So probably going to have some insane loot. But today... This start was actually insane. We got so much loot from that raid. Got ourselves a lot of PvP as well. Raided a few smaller bases too. So I couldn't start. I couldn't ask for a better start, man. Honestly, really happy with it. Alright boys, so that is the end of episode 1. Now in episode 2 is going to get 10 times more crazy. We're going to raid that base. The whole server gets over there, tries to counter. It's going to be absolutely insane. It's probably going to be the best raid that I have ever done on Escalation yet. So I hope that you guys are excited for this. I hope you guys will be looking forward. But yeah, that's going to be end of episode 1. If you guys want episode 2 to come out tomorrow, make sure to drop a like. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.